Meet three-year-old Bryson Williams. Bryson is a student at the Perlman Center. The Center at Cincinnati Children's is a national leader in providing evidence-based models of therapies for preschool children with cerebral palsy and other motor disorders. Because he has CP, Bryson's mobility is limited. To help him get around easier, a group of middle school students from the Seven Hills School recently took a toy Ferrari and modified it so that Bryson could be on the move. If we deliver this car to Bryson, it'll make it possible for him to be mobile on his own for a little bit of every day. The Seven Hills students spent many lunch hours in the school's innovation lab. It's a place where students are asked to identify a problem that someone else has and come up with a prototype or product to help address it. Oh, I'm very proud of the kids. You know, they give up their lunch time to do this. They have come with so much enthusiasm every single time that we meet, and they've never lost sight of the purpose. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. The purpose was fulfilled when the students and their teachers delivered the car to Bryson at the Perlman Center, where he took it for a spin. Bryson's car will help him do more than just get around. It also will help improve his vision and language skills. But those may not be the most important things that Bryson will learn. The biggest thing is going to be from a social standpoint, he's going to be able to get to play with his older brothers doing things that they're doing. They both have cars also, and they're very excited about him being able to participate in that fun leisure activity with his brothers. Bryson's car is now at home with him. And while Bryson still cannot walk on his own or use kitchen utensils or hold a cup by himself, he can now know the joys of playing with his brothers. And the students at the Seven Hills School can feel a sense of accomplishment from a job well done. Can you high five them all? Hi. Here you go. Hi. Can you give him five too? I don't have the <laughs>